So here's my tar carbon tetrachloride that I'm going to draw the Lewis dot structure of. Carbon has four valence electrons. Chlorine has seven valence electrons. There are four of them. So 28 plus four gives me 32 total valence electrons. Put carbon in the middle as my least electronegative atom. Bond the chlorines around it. This is used up eight electrons, so now I need to use up two, four, six for each chlorine to complete the octet. And then I can see that I have four equal bonds around the carbon, each of 109.5 degrees, giving me what's called a tetrahedral shape. This tetrahedral shape then is perfectly symmetrical and perfectly symmetrical means that it is nonpolar. This is a nonpolar molecule, even though I have polar bonds. And that is my carbon tetrachloride Lewis dot structure with polarity.